Hey, how's it going? It's day three still. It's at night. I'm Peter again, if you don't know my name. Going for my walk. Near the end of my walk. I've been walking for, I don't know, but more than an hour now. So I'm going to do a 5K walk. Haven't, this is my first time hitting a 5K walk since months ago, or at least for this current 100 days. So, of course, I'm doing the 100 days thing. This is day three. That earlier video, I put it out there. That's me drinking. Uh, that was this morning. I'm actually surprised that I went to the gym today. I'm Somehow I made it out. I made sure that I did it. Wasn't at my best, but I did it. Point five miles and to go. Time. There's one the Nike hour, telling me three minutes. How far I've done. Eight seconds. If you can Average it. pace twenty one eleven. I don't know maybe mile. I was blocking the mic a bit. But anyways. Uh, this is late at night. The lighting's probably really bad in this video. Uh, what I want to get to, I'm gonna talk to you about weekly goals, but before I get to that, yeah, really sluggish. Um, it's a different kind of pain that I'm getting with my legs. The first time I did legs last week, I did them at like 60% max and two sets instead of my usual three and pain. Like the next day, yeah, barely walking. The second day is always the worst for some reason. Uh, and yeah, still pain for like three, three and a half days, but that was because I hadn't done my legs in a long time. Now I did legs again so for basically a week two and, and that was two days ago. And it was a different type of pain. No real physical pain in terms of getting up the stairs, you know, you know, doing any kind of lunging, lunges kind of thing. It wasn't as bad, but it was more of a mental kind of sluggish pain. Like, it was really hard for me to get out of bed yesterday, even more so today, of course, from drinking. And the legs, especially at day two, then the legs are even even harder. Uh, so I haven't gone for my run yet because well, maybe I could have done tonight, but I want to take it easy. I'll try to do a run tomorrow. So today I'll tell you what I did. Went to the gym and I did biceps and back. Uh, five uh, different exercises, you know, by uh, biceps, uh, curls, and with the machine, of course, the back, the low row, and stuff like that. But anyways, weekly goals, that's what I want to get into, and I'll just do it shortly. Uh, I usually like to make bi-weekly goals, uh, what I'm trying going to try to do for that week. So my current ones are uh, run three times a week, um, gym three times a week. So far, I've been doing that last week and this week easily. And so run three times a week, gym three times a week, uh, beer, and that's all my list, two times a week or less, just to ease into it. Because before the last month and a half, I've been doing it more like three days or four days a week sometimes, but try to do, and again, drank last night and once like five days ago. So that's my two done for the week. Hopefully this weekend might not be as eventful. Trying to refocus on that. But anyways, again, run three days a week, gym three days a week, beer two days or less a week. These are my bi-weekly goals. So that's for this week and next week. And I think I had one more. Oh, bike and bike two days a week. I crashed and burned a few days ago. I still haven't gone and it's been about four days. I got to fit one in in the next two days. So I'm trying to do those goals bi-weekly every Sunday. That's in a few days. And that's it for day three. Um, sweating like a maniac, of course, still. While I'm doing my 5K, I'm almost done. I got about 10 more minutes to go. And that's it. Uh, we'll talk more about other stuff in day four. See you then.